My name is Damian Garcia. I'm the owner of Hidden Fairway Golf Club in Tampa, Florida. We're an indoor driving range in North Hyde Park. I felt that there was a big need for indoor golf in the area. I've always been an avid golfer, but I noticed that people in downtown Tampa were having to drive 30 minutes to go play anytime after 6 p.m. So I tried to bring the best of everything in an environment where they can be here from 5 a.m. to 2 a.m. I originally learned about the Florida SBDC at USF when I was actually a USF student. Uh, I remember seeing it, I believe, back in 2014, 2015, when I was actually a bicycle delivery driver for Jimmy John's. And I kept it in the back of my head. And right around COVID, when the wheels for a business started, that's where I, I reached out. I can only say good things about the Florida SBDC at USF. When I spoke to Pablo for the first time, I've approached him with a couple of business ideas. Some he's agreed that are great, some have been not so great. It's a great way to talk about your business more than anything, but also learn about the appropriate steps that you need to follow. SBDC has been great from the beginning, from market research on where we were going to build the place, down to just how to talk about my business. You can sit there and try to think about everything you can, but until you get an outside perspective of what your business actually looks like, you really don't know much. Like I said, starting with market research, where we really grew, we got some help when it came to being found on Google. And then once we started getting members down to things like how to do our taxes, how to manage the finances, one of the biggest suggestions we got early on was to use the QuickBooks setup. The Florida SBDC at USF was really instrumental in us getting our startup funds going. We had a little bit of money in advance, but setting up the LLC and setting it up correctly really legitimized us to lenders. We spoke to a couple of lenders and a few off the top of my head that really helped us out was upgrade for over 25,000 and then we had another 25 to 30,000 from American Express as well. Uh, we would not have been able to do it if we didn't have such a thorough plan in advance and having set up that LLC you know, from day one. Our biggest success so far has just been selling out. Uh, the numbers when we ran the business plan were a little bit more conservative. We wanted to make sure we were honest, but within seven months we sold out. Our goal was to have 30 members. We have 30 unlimited members, but also we have a punch pass membership that brings our total membership to around 70. The SBDC at USF was really monumental in us getting loans and us getting approved and seen by banks. So as we improve and as we grow, probably go back to the Florida SBDC at USF to secure more loans for our future locations. One of the things I've learned in business is that it's not always going to be perfect. There's always going to be something that you can work on. It's like a house, it's a labor of love. But at the end of the day, build a good plan, talk to the SBDC, and make sure that you have a good support system around you, and it'll probably flourish.